A live look at DFW International Airport this morning. Some passengers with a rough landing on an American Airlines flight after their brakes malfunctioned. Chris Adegui is live there this morning. And Chris, we have seen so many issues lately with the aircrafts. We're lucky in this situation nobody got hurt. Yes, Mark, and this morning, yet another FAA investigation into the malfunction of a plane, this time here at DFW, where a plane overran the runway on Saturday night. The information that we have from the FAA is the American Airlines flight landed here from Washington, D.C. at 7.41 p.m. Saturday, then ran out of runway while trying to stop because of a braking malfunction. There were 99 passengers and six crew members on board, according to American. None were injured, and they were bussed from the plane to the terminal. The plane involved was a Boeing 737-800. That is not the same model under scrutiny for recent malfunctions, including a door flying off an Alaska Airlines flight last month. Instead, this is a model that was manufactured back in 2009. Still, this does come just one week after the new chief of the FAA testified on Capitol Hill that more oversight is needed on those Boeing production lines. American Airlines did send a statement saying they'll cooperate fully with this latest incident investigation. Mark and Kara, back to you. All right.